Okay guys, here is how you can change the region on your iPhone. So welcome back to this Fox Tech video again. I already told you what we're gonna do. So this is important for a variety of reasons, like accessing region specific apps, services and media. So I will walk you through the different settings where the region applies and how you can manage these settings. So let's dive right in. First, let's start with the basic region settings that apply to various aspects of your iPhone, including app availability and certain system settings. To check or change this region setting, open the settings app on your iPhone, scroll down until you find the general section and tap on it. Next, select the language and region option. Here you'll see the current country or region that you have set. If you want to switch to a different country or region, you can easily do so by tapping on it and selecting a new one. There are no specific conditions you need to meet to make this change. It's not like you have to physically be in that country. Now let's talk about the region settings for the App Store and app purchases. This setting can be a bit more complicated because it involves payment methods and availability of apps and services that vary by country. Here's how you can manage these settings. Open the settings app on your iPhone and tap on your name at the top to access your Apple ID information. Within the Apple ID section, select media and purchases. Then tap on view account towards the bottom. In the account settings, look for the country slash region option. Tap on it to view your current country or region settings. You might be prompted that you have active subscriptions in case you want to change to a different one, for example, like Apple Music or whatever it is, that needs to be canceled before you can change the country or region. If this happens, go back to the main Apple ID settings, select subscriptions and cancel the necessary subscriptions temporarily. After you have checked or changed your country or region, of course, you can re-enable any cancelled subscriptions if you wish to continue using them. This ensures that all your services and purchases are in line with your preferred region. And that's it. Now you know how to check and manage the region settings on your iPhone. This can help you access specific content and services available in your chosen region. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Foxtech for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching and until next time, peace.